you know, it's, it's ironic because I literally, as that thing broke out of that gate, I was about to say, well, it appears this town's abandoned and it's a ghost town. And then, Gaia? looks like it's not completely abandoned. There appears to be life. Okay. How are you gonna get across? Oh, what the? Okay, lady, you need to calm down before you jump another 50-foot gap like that. Give me some fair warning, please. <gasps> there it is. Oh, wait. What? No way this is gonna work. God, he's like coming right for us. What the? Okay, maybe he doesn't have the best eyesight. Alright, let's get the heck out of here. God, look at those feet. They're huge. And you know what they say about the size of your feet? What? Oh. What? Oh. What? <laughs> oh. He phases through it. So there's some kind of... You know, I'm trying to make sense of everything that's been happening so far, and I've, I think I've done a pretty good job. But here it's kind of hard to make sense of it, because it appears that they're, this town was being bombarded by, um, you know, some... People from the outside, trolls and dwarfs, and oh god, what is he doing to that thing? Did he just eat it? Oh Jesus! Is being bombarded by something from the outside, and then they were frozen instantaneously. But also the people in the town were, so maybe there's like a third party or something else, like this yeti or whatever it is, can freeze people instantly, and it somehow came in to the city and froze everybody and now is slowly eating them otherwise I have no idea okay he's found us holy god run for your life Oh my god, his feet are like right up on top of me. No! Hey, <laughs> Hey, hurry up. How do I run faster? There's gotta be a way. Okay, yeah, yeah. He's gonna rip the top of this house and chuck it up. Thousand yards. Oop. The brothers went the same way this time. Like, I'm running as fast as I can. Oh, did I make it this time? Ah, oh, he fell. It's like a monster from Lost or something. Oh. Okay, you're just throwing yourself at me there, lady. I guess she doesn't have much choice anymore. Can't be too picky. Okay. This. <laughs> I'm kind of speechless. I don't know what to say. This isn't a good time to be trying to make out. My little brother's right here, right, lady? Plus, we're on a mission to save my dad. There's the Northern Lights, or the Aurora Borealis, which are really pretty, by the way. 
I live in uh, Minnesota, and sometimes you can see them on uh, clear nights. This is her love shack. He's like, listen, I want to go in this love shack. Why you always got to be such a buzzkill, man? Let me just go with my woman. Don't be jealous. Don't be hating. Because you don't got a crazy acrobatic woman of your own. Oh god, and we're about to run into giant spiders, aren't we? That's what this is. It's a spider den. They've been wrapped up into... Yep. <laughs> Oh god, she's evil. She was evil this entire time. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, she's assumed her true form. So that's why... <laughs> yeah. The sound she's making is creepy. Uh -oh. So that's why the uh, savages were trying to kill her, maybe? Is because they knew she was actually like a spider? Explains a lot. This is like that scene from Pirates of the Caribbean. No. What the? Whoa! Oh, did I just rip her leg off? Oh, that's gross. I'm sorry. Listen, if you uh, still want to get together sometime, I'm totally free. Like, I'm hitting you, lady. There we go. I hit her a bunch of times. Rip her other leg off. Rip it off. There we go. I feel like I should have probably ripped off a leg from the same side so she can't walk anymore. There you go. I do this out of love. What? How? What? How could she still balance? This is brutal. I gotta like rip off her legs until she dies. Yeah, I guess I can't have her tricking any more people and trying to kill us. Still walking around with one leg. I got stabbed. It's like Romeo. Wait, that's her fangs too. That's poisonous. Uh oh. The father? What? He knows. He can sense something's wrong. There's a, a disturbance in the force. At first when he like jumped up, I was like I was like, there's no way this is all a dream. It was one of those moments where it was all just a dream and I was about to be really mad, but then I realized no, he just he got a feeling. <laughs> 